as the controversy associated with the new neural note rages on, our top source brings you the latest update on the controversial policy of the Central Bank of Nigeria, CBN. The details of the meeting between the National Chairman of the Progressive Congress, APC, Abdul Hai Adamu, and governors elected on the platform of the ruling party has emerged. Niger News learned that Adamu on Sunday joined the governors to call on President Mondabari to obey the Supreme Court order on Naira redesign policy. The Supreme Court had temporarily restrained the Central Bank of Nigeria, CBN, and the federal government from banning the use of the old Naira notes from February 10. The APS Court gave this ruling on an expert application filed by the government of Kaduna, Kogi, and Zamfara states. President Buhari, however, in a nationwide broadcast, directed the CBN to make available the old 200 Naira notes for the next 60 days, which elapses on April 10. APC governors, in their reaction to Buhari's directives, order that the old notes remain illegal tender in their states. President Manubari on Sunday appealed for more patience from Nigerians over the crisis faced by Nigerians over the Central Bank of Nigeria, CBN Naira policy. President Buhari on Sunday said he is aware of the hardship faced by Nigerians, adding that the policy is meant to improve Nigeria's economy. The president stated this in a video recording from Ethiopia where he attended the just concluded African Union summit. He said, I'm appealing to you to exercise further patience as we take appropriate measures to ease these hardships. God willing, there will be light at the end of the tunnel. The senior special assistant to the president on media and publicity, Gaba Shehu, revealed this in a statement he signed on Sunday titled in a video to sway voters for Tinubu, President Bari vows to end current hardship. He also charged Nigerians to vote for the presidential candidate of the Progressive Congress, APC Bola Tinubu. The governor of Kaduna State, Nasa Erufai, has insisted on old 500 naira and 1,000 naira being legal tender in the state. Naya News reports that Erufai directed its ministries, departments, and agencies not to reject old naira notes. Erufai stated this in a statement released on Sunday through the special advisor to the governor on media and communication, Muyiwa Adekeye. According to the Kanan state governor, the old and new Naira notes should keep circulating in the state. He said the directive is in line with the subsistent order of the Supreme Court on the Naira notes. My viewers at home, was your reaction to this report? Please uh, drop your reaction in the comment section and your voice will be heard and clear around the world. And ensure you subscribe to our channel for more updates from Daily Express. Naira scarcity is latest CBM news update on Naira note for February 20th, 2023. Uh, please uh, drop your reaction in the comment section and your voice will be and clear around the world. And ensure you subscribe to our channel for more updates from Daily Express. Uh, thanks and God bless. Uh, let's see. You are now asking Barry to obey Supreme Court order, but we are unable to beg him to obey court order and release Nam de Kano. Okay, that is according to Obed Okoro. What's your reaction to Obed Okuru comment here? Please drop your reaction. Ibrahim Sikiru Omotayo uh, replied to Obed Okuru saying uh, inconsequential to national issues. Inconsequential to national issues. 
Then uh, Obed Okuru replied to Ibrahim, uh, 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 saying, uh, uh, saying, uh, you sabi, saying, Now you sabi, okay? Then uh, Sylvester Ogoli says, uh, Don't mind the Mumu people. Plus two, three uh, here says uh, exactly, okay? Uh, the, uh, plus two, they reply to Ibrahim Sekiru saying exactly. But Sirui uh, Bello says that uh, you are talking of an unknown quantity. You are talking of an unknown quantity, okay? Then uh, John Eckberg says that uh, if the continuous detention of Navicano with its attendant security consequences in the southeast is not a national issue to you then you have just exposed your ignorance of what constitutes a national issue okay oh we are still here taking more rations uh, uh, stay tuned please uh, then uh, the next reaction here is from uh, Ignatius Ushi uh, saying that uh, we need to understand that APC has never been a political party. The APC was formed as a conglomerate of different political parties with different and diverse interests. All the parties that formed APC had power greediness in them. Their sole collective interest was to put was to push then PDP out of government which they did and they are now fostering their individual interests okay eluma they replied to ignatius uh, saying uh, exactly are we hearing a bad headsman kidnapping and bandit which stands as a common word of apc god almighty who hates wickedness will use the wicked leaders of this nation as sacrifices for a peaceful new Nigeria in the mighty and victorious name of Jesus Christ. Shinedu Odinaku Duru says that Erufai aim is to push his stock money into the state, banks and projects. Okay, I come again with this place. Say Erufai aim is to push his stock money into the state banks and projects. But no bank in his state will comply with his directives. Let him and his co use those money to sue Agbada and suits. And this is all can take for now. Thanks and God bless. Ensure you subscribe to our channel, spread this report, and bye for now. Please, thanks so much for listening. Do it to spread this report across on this platform. Share it, please. Okay, thanks so much. Bye for now, please.